How to get the black duffel bag in GTA 5 online after the patch of 1.67 So that's what I'm going to be showing y'all in today's video It's a really easy method on how you can get the black duffel bag And yes, this is for all consoles So every single person watching this video uh, Doesn't really matter what console you want, it will work But before we do get into the video, if you do want to join our shark card giveaway All you have to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel, like this video, and comment the word giveaway and by the way, if this method did work for you, make sure you comment it down below so other people trying this out also do know that it works and they could go ahead and get the black duffel bag for themselves. And if you do enjoy uh, like clothing glitches, I also upload car merges, but I also do go live with subscribers and do car meets. So if you're interested about any of those things, just click that red subscribe button and drop a like on this video. Dropping a like is the number one way you can support the channel. But I don't want to waste any more of your time. Just call it. So I accidentally almost called my mobile operation center, but... Uh, yeah, so now it should spawn like nearby and I'm just gonna have to go to it And by the way for this method right here make sure you don't skip any parts in the video that way you don't miss Like you don't have to watch the outro, but like make sure you do watch the whole glitch that way you don't miss anything uh, Important because I have actually done this glitch in the past and I've missed some steps Which made me redo the whole glitch and trust me do not want to redo this because it's pretty frustrating to having to redo all of this uh, So make sure you pay close attention to what I'm doing now once you, do, yeah, ignore my terabyte, I know it looks pretty ugly, but just walk inside your terabyte. Now once you walk, you should go in front of this screen right here, this blue screen. You're going to have to click right on the D-pad, and now it's going to do this animation. You're going to have to click on Client Jobs, and you're going to have to start this one right here called Robbery in Progress. I had a timer, I don't know why, but there, the timer ran out. So just start it out, and this will say Client Job. You have to go back onto the screen. I was going to put you on these cameras. Now, as you can see, you're just going to have to scroll through the cameras until you see like a robbery. So you should see like police and stuff like that. So just like this one right here, as you can see, there's police, they're shooting. So that's the right one. And it's going to gonna click on X once again, and then you're just going to back out. So just follow what it's saying. I was going to tell you to go to Pacific Standard Bank. Now, it might not be the exact same for you. Like for you, it might be in Sandy Shores. It might be like in like anywhere it's really random like where the robbery so in this video this is where it was at but for you it might be in a different location but doesn't matter uh, where it is located now what you're gonna have to do is just make your way to that bank and uh, by the way if you die it doesn't really matter you won't have to restart the whole glitch so you could die as many times just make sure you don't die after like later on i will say one though so make sure you keep watching that there has never been a better time to purchase a modded account on GTA 5 Online. And the best place at the moment right now is GTAOps.com. GTAOps.com are fairly new on the market but very trustworthy and also really fast delivery. They all offer a variety of modded accounts, boosting services, and a lot more. If you do want to go check out GTA Ops, they have stacked modded accounts with boosting services. I will leave a link in the description down below and let's get back to the video. That way, you know when uh, like you can't die. So now you just kill everyone. You don't need an oppressor for this, but that's what I did. I just blew everything up and make sure you kill the juggernaut here. I mean, he was already dead for me, but I don't know. I suggest using explosives. And now what you're going to have to do is just kill the bank robbers just like this and just pick up the duffel bag. So as you can see, there's a duffel bag. It's a steal the gold. Now you picked up the duffel bag. Uh, now keep watching the video because I will show you how to actually save this. So I know a lot of people might be confused. Like, how do you save this? It's actually very easy. Like, you only need like about two steps to save this. So now the first thing which you will have to do is you will need to complete the mission. But you need to complete this mission in a certain way. So you can't just like finish the mission and keep the duffel bag. What you will have to do is get inside a flying vehicle. It could be like any helicopter. You're going to have to jump out. And what you will have to do, now this might be a little bit tricky. You're gonna have to jump out of your flying vehicle, open your parachute, you're gonna have to land on that yellow circle. So you see the yellow circle, now it might not be on the same location for you, but what you have to do is land on top of the yellow circle. And just like this, as you can see, I landed exactly on it. It might take you a couple of tries, but it's pretty easy actually. Now what you're gonna have to do is just make your way to ammunition. So this is the first step done, now the second step or the second step is kind of like two steps. Uh, you have to make your way to ammunition. And you're going to have to have this specific parachute. So you're going to have to go to parachutes right over here. By the way, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you click that red subscribe button. And drop a like on this video. I haven't done so already. So uh, yeah, let's try to hit like 300 likes on this video. Highly appreciate it if we do. Just equip the Ezreal parachute. So I already have it equipped. But if you don't have it equipped, just equip it. As you can see Ezreal parachute. Now open your interaction menu, go to styles, go to parachutes, and put it on on. 
just like this you see it on your back now what you're gonna have to do is just make your way to the mask store in a flying vehicle and basically this is the last part of the glitch so this is the last step, step and you will actually have the black duffel bag now you're gonna have to jump out like around here and what we'll do is actually we're gonna have to land by the yellow or blue t-shirts so around the left of the mask store you're gonna have to land right next to the blue t-shirt and spam right on the d-pad now as you can see i didn't perfectly land so it doesn't have to be like absolutely perfect i remember the first time i did this glitch it did actually take me a really long time because i was trying to land perfectly you really don't have to as long as you're next to the like as you can see i landed like really bad and i still got it i just walked a little bit and spammed right on the d-pad and boom once you're on the screen just save this outfit this was my second try i don't know the first time that i did this it didn't actually show the duffel bag so now you go to the interaction menu and then you equip the outfit as you can see i got the black duffel bag so it's definitely pretty cool now uh, keep watching the video this is the last thing very important don't click off because i know a lot of y'all gonna click off and you're not gonna know how to switch outfits as you can see it doesn't let me switch outfits if i want to switch outfits you're just to see yo go to styles go to once to the right and once to the left and you will see that your duffel bag disappeared and now you can change outfits so that's how you could change the outfit with this uh, duffel bag right here so it is a bit different from like other methods but it's definitely pretty easy and this method was 100% solo by the way if this method did work for you make sure you comment it down below so other people trying this out or that are looking at the comments down below also do know that it works and they could go ahead and get the black duffel bag for themselves as well by the way, I will be having a video coming out in around a week, which is going to be called How to Get Every Color Duffel Bag in GTA 5 Online. So I'll be dropping it in about a week. So make sure you do subscribe to my YouTube channel. That way you don't miss it. You know, whenever I do upload it, I'll probably upload it in around a week. Make sure you turn on post notifications on too. And drop a like on this video. Dropping a like is the number one way you can show support to my YouTube channel. And I would highly appreciate it, you know, uh, if you do drop a like. But I think I did say enough, here are some videos that will pop up on the screen. So one is going to be top five clothing glitches and the other one will be some like random video. But I'm going to see you there.